Hello everyone, and thank you for coming again, but for our off-site location being digital and uh, we wanna be safe and secure from all this crazy virus, but we are very excited that you are here with us over the internet for your character education. And this is the place where we talk all about things and not just any things, I'm talking about important things that go inside of you to change the world around you. We call them big ideas and this month it's huge. So are you ready to find out what it is? Let's start a drum roll. Let's see, you're gonna have to do it at home. Here we go, three, two, one. <laughs> That's not the big idea. Uh, Andrew, nice yeah, to Corey. see you today. Uh, what you doing there, bud? Well, you know, I'm just here. Just here to help. Okay. I'm not Andrew, though. I am the great Andrew Weeny. Andrew Weeny. That's, that's, uh, like that's weird. Andrew um, Weeny. Yeah, it's not the big idea. And in fact, I'm not certain what this is at all. Um, that's because I am a mystery wrapped up in a riddle and buried in a conundrum. A conundrum? Yeah. Big uh, vocabulary word for you. I don't know what kind of drum that is, but it sounded mysterious. Like me. Andrew Weeny. So, why are you... Why are you wearing... I'm just... Why? Okay, listen, I can tell, I can tell you are amazed and yet you haven't even seen my new skills. I am, I'm simply spending time and effort to learn something new and rewarding. Uh, let me guess. You want to be a magician. Oh, yeah. Wow, <laughs> that was amazing. Okay, read that. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. According to this letter from Marvin's Magical Illusions by Mel, I already am a magician. Congratulations, magician. Uh huh. You should now be ready with your wand, your cape, your hat, and each week you'll receive a new kit. <laughs> You're so excited about this, including all that you need. Um, to add to your stage act, but remember to practice, practice, mm -hmm. practice, 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 mm -hmm. and don't give up. Sincerely, Marvin. Ladies and gentlemen, and kids of good vision, watch and be amazed. Watching this corner? Yeah. See it. You can't see it. Ready? Check that out. I hid the rope. You couldn't see it in my hand, and now I made it <laughs> come back. <laughs> you not? Are you not? Thank you. Thank you. That was okay. Well, this is the only trick that they sent you in the middle. Oh no! No! no wait! 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 wait. There, there's more. There's more. Yeah, yeah. Goody. So, that was just the opener, you know, just to loosen you up a little bit. Uh -huh. This is the real deal. Use the same rope. Okay. And, um, let's see. Oh, you're going to cut the rope and then um, make it look like it's not cut. Wait, wait, wait you can do that? <laughs> I, I can't, but you're a magician. Oh, wow. No, I didn't. I didn't know that was a thing. Um, but you're supposed to be able to tie my hands behind my back, and then I will escape. Thank you. Okay. Um, so, uh, I don't... Here. You... So I just tie... Yeah, tie my... Well, you can't... Here. Okay. Alright, I need to tie my hands up. Yeah. I'm just gonna do this with social distancing. Touch the shirt. Yeah, I'll wash my hands. Purell? Uh-huh. Okay. Okay, make it tight. Make sure, like real tight. Yeah, make sure I could never, ever escape. Okay. Okay. I don't know about this, Andrew. Okay. Um. All right. You should be good now. Like okay. Double. Okay. Double. All right. I got. Okay. Now, what else do you need me to do? Uh, just simply remove my cape. Can you can you remove my cape? Okay. And hold it in front of my arms. 
Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh-huh. Like this? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah. Now, now just, okay, uh, oh, okay. I'm pretty impressed. Okay. Are you sure about uh, this? Yeah, I got, I got it. Just, okay. just like, take time. Now, hey, uh, weren't, weren't you getting to reveal, weren't you about to reveal the big idea, Corey? Yes. Uh, okay, uh, I have to hold your keep though. How am I supposed to do a drill? Okay, just lay it right here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. And uh, just distract, the distract them. I mean, I mean, <laughs> leave them in the definition. Okay, everyone. We'll just count it down again. Three, two, one. Determination. Determination uh, is deciding it's worth it to finish what you started. And now, just for the people who think that Andrew is going to be determined and get out of this mess, why don't you repeat it one more time? Determination, deciding it's worth it to finish what you started. Uh, oh, ye of little faith. Ah, uh, Corey, are do you did you read the instructions? In what? The instructions. Instructions? Yes. That's the letter! But it has the instructions with the magic kit. There was, there was more? You didn't finish reading no, this? No, I... No, I just wanted to get to the good stuff, Corey! Okay. Uh, well, did you hear the big idea definition, Andrew? Andrew Weenie. I am the great Andrew Weenie, Corey. Did you hear the definition and the big idea, Look, I'm a Andrew little busy. <laughs> I am busy trying to get out of this right now. Well, the big idea says that you decide it's worth it to finish what you start. Well, yeah, okay, I'm trying. I... No, it means, like, sometimes you, you gotta refer to this letter. Like, you gotta go back and practice, 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 practice. Practice, you have to actually read the directions in order to start. Or you could just hand me my wand instead of talking. Really? Yes, it's down there. Um... Which end was in your mouth? I don't want to touch this. Uh, you probably shoot it. Uh, I can touch okay. it. Okay, okay, look. Just that's the chewed side. Oh, well, I don't have a hand. With so... the hair on it. Oh, that's gross. <laughs> you want a neck? Mm -hmm. Nope. All right. Just, uh. Here you go. Oh. Okay. Okay, okay. I. I just. Corey. Yeah. I. You got this. This is not. It's not working. Okay. Okay. Uh, I don't think that this is gonna work at all. I'm gonna get out of this. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh -huh. What? This. <laughs> Are you giving up, Andrew? Probably. Okay. Well, I think that uh, I I failed, Corey. I'm not a magician. I I'm never gonna be a magician. Okay. I can't. I can't even feel my hands right now. This is impossible. Okay, but Andrew, Eni, Andrew, Eni. Don't call me that anymore. <laughs> you can do this. You can do anything you put your mind to if you show some determination and read the no, directions. No, I can't, Corey. This is just not possible. I don't have the power. Well, I, I think I can help. Uh, we will have to get Andrew, Eni, a special escape tool. What? Maybe some scissors or something? Oh, Corey, I saw some scissors over there. <laughs> yes. Uh, okay. Uh, drop your wand. I'm not touching it. Okay. Then, then, oh, oh, what? Hey, hey! Oh. Ta-da! I did it! I'm free! <laughs> I, I'm free. Thank you. Well, Thank you, Corey. Maybe next oh. time with a little bit more practice, some determination and some reading of the instructions, I think uh, after you spend a couple of hours, hours okay. practicing, you know, like sometimes when we're doing lessons like soccer lessons or swimming, maybe even just math. Man, that stuff doesn't come oh, easy. Oh, like when I took guitar lessons. Yes. Oh. And you got to show determination. Well, you, you know what? Uh, determination can set you free. Uh, sometimes, literally, right? I mean, you're, you're right. It, I'm right. Yeah. You are. First time you said that, I'm a little bit scared. <laughs> what? Why are you scared to hear that? Well, I don't know, Andrew. Um, it's not. I mean, it's not fear. That, that, my friend, is a realization that there are people with such power amongst us. People with special abilities that that many of us should stand in awe. 
Are you, you trying to get... I'm transitioning to a demonstration of determination via video that will boggle everyone's mind. Well, I think that we can play it safe, and uh, now that you don't have your wand or cape, yeah, you can keep the hat on. You sure? Okay, yeah. it covers your bald head. Okay. Uh, well, at least take these, get some more practice in, I think you'll be fine. You ready to learn more about determination? Yeah. All right, let's hey, do it. Watch this trick. Okay, I got more practice to do. Okay. Hey everybody, we've almost made it. It's almost the end of the school year. Almost, but hey, not quite the end. Have you ever gotten started on something difficult and then wanted to quit? Like maybe you've worked on one of these for hours and the colors are still all mixed up. Or maybe you wanted to learn how to do something new, like play one of these. Or bake one of these. But once you figured out how much time and effort it would take you threw in the towel, hey, it happens to all of us. That's why this month is the perfect month to talk about determination. There will be times your whole life that you want to quit, give up, shut it down, but when those times come, you can push through to the end. One way you can do that is to remember why you started. What was it that made you want to play an instrument, bake something amazing, try something new? Focusing on that reason can help you when times get tough. Another way to keep from giving up is to focus on the finish line. When you can see the end just in front of you, uh, sometimes, that's enough motivation to keep going until you cross that line. And here's one more thing about determination. It really helps to have someone on your side, encouraging you to keep going. So you guys, I want you to hear me say, I believe in you. Your teachers believe in you. The people you live with believe in you. We all think you can do whatever you set your mind to and we can't wait to watch you do it. So one last time for this year, all together, let's hear it. I know I'm sad, you, maybe you're sad too. Determination is deciding it's worth it to finish what you started. And it is worth it. One more time, all together. Determination is deciding it's worth it to finish what you started. It's been another awesome year, you guys. I can't wait to see you again. Have a great summer. What is up guys? Welcome. You know that we're talking about determination, so we're going to run through that definition one more time for you guys, right? Determination is deciding that it's worth it to finish what you've started. And so there's, I mean, a lot of things in our life that we need determination for. It could be homework or uh, sports or, um, I ran out of words and I just, um, take three. I lost my mojo. What is up guys, welcome. You know that we're talking about determination, so we're gonna run through that definition one more time for you guys. Determination is deciding that it is worth it to finish what you've started. And there's a lot of things in our life that we're gonna start, whether it's school or chores or, um, you know, having to do homework or sports or whatever it is, we have a lot of things that we need to get done, but sometimes there's obstacles in our lives, right? So I have this bin full of, well, it's ping pong balls, but we're gonna pretend that they're obstacles. And a lot of times we have goals we wanna to get to, but there's these little obstacles in the way. Maybe it's video games that are distracting you from your homework, or maybe your siblings are bothering you while you're trying to do your chores, or you see your friends playing fun games outside, but you really need to be practicing for soccer tryouts that are coming up. Whatever it is, whatever distractions are keeping you from your goal, they, they happen a lot in our lives. And, and well, the thing is we, we need to look past those. We can't be stuck on our distractions. Instead, we need to look at our goal. And that is where determination comes in. You see, determination allows us to reach those goals and look past 
the distractions. And so when you're determined maybe to practice for your soccer tryouts, all your distractions start to move. And then you're determined to finish your chores so that you can go play video games, more distractions are gone. And then you just keep adding determination into all of the objects of your life. And eventually, you reach your goals, guys. So when you're wondering, what is determination going to do for me? Well, when you use it properly and you don't focus on the distractions and instead focus on your goals, it helps you reach them, guys. So I hope you enjoyed this. It was really fun and I will see you guys later. Remember, determination is deciding that it is worth it to finish what you started. Bye. You don't have to. Are you sure? Oh, no, 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 no. <clears throat> Hey there, I'm MC Haggis, and next to me is my beatboxing partner, Seamus McFamous. Say hi to him, Seamus. Hi! Oh, 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 right, right, right. Sorry. Uh. <laughs> Folks, Seamus here has had a bit of an accident. He, uh, he sprained his lips. Uh. Yeah, there's something you don't see every day. <laughs> uh, you, you see, Seamus was doing a beatboxing solo at one of our concerts that went on for 20 minutes. It was epic. Uh. And just as he got to the finish, <laughs> Boom! Spray, sprained his lips. Sprained his lips. So he has to wear this lip splint for a few days. Oh, hey, you're looking thirsty, my friend. Huh? Yeah. Here you go. Here you go. Here you go. Oh, all right. <laughs> Sorry, I got a little too much. I, I told Seamus not to worry about doing this video today, but he was determined to come and help, which is a great example of this month's life app. Determination, uh, deciding it's worth it to finish what you started. Uh, you want some more water? Uh, yeah, there you go. There you go. Uh, oh, there you go. Okay, that's enough water for right now. Uh, uh, Alrighty. Uh, now, okay, now I read on Web Doctor Guy somewhere that in order to prevent bruising, you need to elevate the sprained areas to lessen the blood flow. So go ahead and, yeah, go ahead and raise, yeah, raise this, spray, yeah, look up, elevate, elevate, yeah, like that. But you need to keep it below your heart. Huh? Yeah, so get, yeah, raise it. Uh, keep it uh, yeah, just like that. Uh, uh, all right, all right. Uh, no, no, that's all right. That's uh, all right. You know, I bet you're wondering uh, how Seamus uh, is going to be able to help me with the rap. Well, here's how much determination my friend has. He has brought along different things to help him beatbox. So without any further ado, he brought some instruments to help him lay down a fat beat. Kick it. Sometimes finding motivation takes a lot of inspiration, but you'll feel some exultation when you decide to finish what you started, and that's determination. Word. So, I mean, how, do you have to replace the splint? Huh? Oh, you do? Oh, huh? oh, oh. can I try? How's it look? Okay, let's kick it. Huh? What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? What's up guys, my name is Trey and this is Tucker and we are excited to hang out and play a game with you guys and so here's how this game is going to work. We're actually going to do a dance battle but they have a special theme for this dance battle. What's the theme Tucker? Unfortunately it's Fortnite dance moves. We say unfortunately because you guys may love Fortnite but we don't know anything about Fortnite. I played it a few times, you played it a few times but we're going to attempt these dances. If you know these dances just brace yourself because we're probably not going to do very well but I'm hoping that I beat Tucker and I think Tucker thinks he's going to beat me. I am determined to be victorious in this. But we will we will see if that determination pays off. So are we ready to hit start? Yeah, I think we All should right. start. Okay. Let's go. I'm like already starting to sweat. I don't know if I've been for sweating this. for a while. That's a personal problem. You should see your doctor. It's a black shirt, so okay. you can't tell. What is okay? What is the light up grenade? I don't what know. 
Okay. I don't. Th is this part of the game? I don't know, but I'm not a. Okay, I know the rocket launcher is. I know that. The rocket launcher. Yeah. That guy has a sword. I don't. I feel just like have I like the that. generic Fortnite skin. I okay. was never good enough. I don't want to buy battle passes. I don't buy battle passes. Don't buy it. Not a, not a okay. battle pass. So, I don't know I'm gonna go first. Okay. Okay. So you first, Tucker. Let's see. Do I need. I'll give you. I'll give you your space. Just in okay. case. Round one. Yeah. I can't keep a beat. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's it. Is that like a basic Fortnite game? Like, yeah, I think. Like the intro one? Yeah, I think that's one you don't have to buy and don't have to be really good at. Okay. Okay, All right. here we go. Let's see it. Three, two, one. Ooh, I like My arms are going wrong. There we go. You go yeah, you go, that's pretty good. You got your feet and your arms at the same. That's pretty good. This is hurting! Are you tired? <laughs> okay, that's no, pretty good. good. Oh, give me that. Thank give you. me that. My turn. Team B. Oh. That's oh my lot, goodness, that's I, a lot I don't know if I, I move, move up, I might, I might pull something. So hand on the head, hand on the belt, belly, belly or belt, okay. And, and then just kind of, and then just kind of kick. Three, okay. rip my pants, two, we'll just, we'll get some one. Okay, okay. okay. Alright, ready? Oh! I think you need to go a little bit wider. Wait, do I have to do this? I think I have to do this. I have to hold up quick. Yeah, you have to hold this. Because it says, like, take me out. Hey! I'm running out of breath. you, dude! How'd I do? I just, I just... Hey, you're not... Oh, okay. That's pretty good, dude. That's really good. All right. How many rounds of this are there? Okay. Five rounds. Yikes. Okay. Should I Oh. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that was yeah. okay. Yeah. Okay. I feel yeah. like you're just significantly yeah. easier than mine. Yeah. See, I just have to. Okay. I just have to. Three. But you have to. I two, feel like you need some hit back. One. Okay, I got you. Got you. Oh, okay. Yeah. 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 All right, I feel like this is slightly rigged. Being Maybe. still. Oh man, I wish. What if I just? Wow, build? that's. Would you all be impressed if I three, salt out my pocket right two, now? That'd be really cool. But ready? One. I've got to go. Super. I've got to. I've got to pull it out and go. No, you don't have to. Okay, sorry, sorry. And, and then he's more standing. So yeah. How'd I do? That's pretty good. Yeah, that's pretty good. Really? That was a very easy I'll take that. Right, but I'm afraid. I get one of those things that's going to get progressively harder. I thought that was a good one. Yeah. Orange chest. Orange chest. Oh, uh, yes! Can you I, do this? Yes! You can do this? Uh, okay. I can't do this. Uh, I'm really gonna, this is called, what's this called? This is called the floss. A floss. Okay. okay, I always thought it was called the floss. I gotta get Three, my position ready. Two, one. I don't know if I'm going with the beats. I feel like your shoes are making a squeaky noise. They are. Okay, that would it's be the shoes, I promise. I can only do it super slow. <laughs> what is this? Is this the rowdy man? Like, what is this? Okay. Alright. Have you ever wrote a book? Three. Oh, I have. Two. Twice. It's awful. One. Alright. Go. Ready? Okay. Is it, is it, what's this called? What's this called? I'm gonna go. The rodeo? That's probably the most incorrect. I can use good hands. Yeah, there you go. Round four. Okay. I feel like next to Are you guys do? Are, have you guys done this before? Maybe, maybe. Alright. What in the world? Flapper, if you can do this, I'm thoroughly impressed. What is, how do you? I feel like three, right, two, let's see it. One. Oh, boom! Well, but well, you gotta move your. I'm you're, trying. You're, you're, you're stepping on your toes. Don't hurt yourself, buddy. Do you see how hard it is? Okay, okay. I got you. I feel but like we, I got it. We, like... We're we're determined to get this. <laughs> that is not a dance. That's not physically possible. Is that what? Is that what? What right. I'm dancing? Oh, watch this. I can. Three. Okay, you ever seen two, those Irish people? It's the same thing. One. Ready? Like this. Oh, that's actually pretty close, dude. That's actually really, really good. I'm from Irish descent, so. Irish descent? Oh, yeah. That's a Round yeah. five. That's, that's why I get some. Uh, round five. Okay. 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 Round five. I feel like it's pretty evenly matched right now. I feel like I can get that last Come on, I just want the one chest, please. I don't even know. What is that? Oh. What is this called? <laughs> Come on, you can do this. But it's this, it's, yeah. I need a replay of that. Three. Can we get an uh, instant replay, sir? Okay, one. I still like it. Go. Okay, now twist. Don't forget to spin. There you go. There you go. Arm, crank that. There we go. Oh, see? Hey! That was pretty good. Okay, I impressed myself. Yeah, Whoa, this is hard. Right. Oh. Okay, I got you. That's a little. We should put our jobs and be dancers. I know. Three, two, one. Okay, one. ready? Oh, you missed it. Oh, yeah. oh I missed the clap. Oh, I'm clapping. I'm clapping. I'm clapping. I'm ready. Oh, we have to go. Oh. 
I feel hey. like we were pretty we were pretty good at that. So that was pretty good. So you think you can Fortnite? That's what we just did. I think Fortnite, it's Fortnite, Fortnite, not fork knife. I had to teach my mother that. And so Fortnite, Fortnite dance. Do we have to determine a winner? Uh, I I think it was so evenly matched. I don't think there really was a winner. I think the really cool part about it was we were both determined to bring our best effort, and that's really what made the competition fun. Instead of like one person being the winner compared to someone being the loser. Yeah, I feel like both of us were actually determined to do our best because if you see us, we're not dancers, but I feel like we were determined and we did a pretty good job. So. Yeah, man, we <laughs> tried our little hearts out. Exactly, we did. Determined. Hey kids, I'm Lawson, and. This thing is, uh, I don't, honestly, I don't know. My iPod crashed and my mom told me I could use this thing instead. All right. Hey, mom, how am I supposed to run Why? Right. Now, you may be wondering why someone as fit and as awesome as me needs to train. Well, I need to be in tip top shape to tell you this story that I heard from my gym teacher's cousin who has this girl in her class named Lucy. Lucy and her friend Kaylee are pretty good at exercising their mouths more than anything else, especially when the teacher's talking. So they see everybody going towards the track and Lucy's like, what did I miss? Oh my gosh. And Kaylee tells her that Miss Ryan was just saying the whole class is running a 5K and they're going to train together. And Lucy is like, wait, Rewind. <laughs> Ms. Ryan says the 5K is to raise money for kids who don't have safe water to drink. And they can have sponsors donate money to help. And Lucy's like, oh my gosh, that's a piece of cake. Right? Like, totally. Lucy's connected online to like her gazillions of aunts and uncles and neighbors, dogs, hairdressers. And she asks them all to donate because she is gonna run this whole 3.1 mile race without stopping to walk. While holding her breath. <gasps> and while doing the chicken dance. <laughs> and within a few minutes, her friends and family have donated like a hundred and fifty nine dollars and six million cents. So she and Kaylee train really, really hard every day, all the way up to race day. The starter goes off and Lucy flies like the wind, but then it gets hot, like really hot. And Lucy starts to sweat a lot. Buckets. And all she wants to do is quit and lie down in the grass, but then she remembers the kids who don't have safe drinking water and how she promised she would finish the race. So she focuses on moving ahead one step at a time. And then like five days later in 600,000 minutes, she sees the finish line. Bow, 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 bow. So kids, I want you to remember this. Sometimes a fanny pack is a good idea. And sometimes it's not. But it's always a good idea to choose determination, deciding it's worth it to finish what you started. See you guys next time. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. Today we kicked off what we hope is a great discussion about determination that you can have at home with your family sitting around this computer even. Corey, you know what? Let's all say it one more time. Okay. Can I repeat it after you? Yes, please. Sorry. Determination. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Can they repeat it too? Yes. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Determination. Determination. Is deciding it's worth it. Is deciding it's worth it to finish what you started. To finish what you started. Right. <laughs> and you don't have to forget, like, this is something that might seem impossible at first as your family to talk about. Um, it might look a little bit different for you to be showing determination now, especially than it, it did last month. But we still need to show it. We still need to work on it. And uh, I think you'll be better off if you do. That's right. Until then, we will see you next time. See ya.